Now that we have created the initial cross-section shape, it is now time to create your first road. Select the Create Edit Road command from the ribbon. At the command line, the software will prompt you to select an alignment. Click on or around the Memphis Street alignment. The Add Road form is now displayed. The name of the alignment is used as the road name. We are going to apply our standard 20 feet template to the road. The surface that we'll be sampling from will be the EG surface. This is the civil 3D surface that currently exists in our drawing. The general cross-section sampling is controlled by changing the spacing across the tangents, arcs and spiral segments along the alignment. We will set this sampling rate to 30 feet. The software will automatically include the extra cross-sections at the geometry points of the alignment. The Use Layers button can be used to add extra cross-section sampling based on the start and end of lines in the drawing that exist on a specific AutoCAD layer. This is useful for adding sections at fixed locations, such as driveways or culverts. Next, select on the Add Extra Sampling button. This option is used to include extra sampling over a selected station range. At stations 260 to 430, we will increase the cross-section sampling to 5 feet. This will improve the accuracy of the design through the horizontal curve. We will be widening this region later on. The tick box to the right allows the user to set whether this extra sampling will be also shown in the vertical grading editor. Select OK to close this form. Next, select Create Update to create Memphis Street. The vertical grading editor will now display with the best fit vertical design profile. As you can see in plan view, the line work for Memphis Street is displayed.